Hi guys, this is Yuli from Free Daily Exercise and this is a little different format of videos today because I'm not talking about exercises. As you know, in a lot of my real-time videos, I started posting, I started putting background music on my videos. The reason why I do that is because I get tired of just watching plain videos and I just don't want to be a boring exercise video. I want to try to like have people get up off their sofa and find time to exercise because I need that for myself as well. I'm always feeling lazy at times. I'm tired from working. I started adding background music just so that, you know, it's like I'm just, I don't want to just be like huffing and puffing, breathing heavy on video. So it's just nice to have different music. I'm not, I am a total beginner on GarageBand. I don't understand all the tools, all the things that you have here and, and all that stuff. I was just basically selecting different types of loops and working off of that, basically. Apple has the software GarageBand and basically it's a software that you can use to create your own music using their various loops and beats and you know, all kinds of, you know, great sounding systems. So you instruments so that you can um, create your own music. Also, if you have your own keyboard or whatever, you can plug it in and all that stuff for people that are more advanced into this stuff. But anyways, so that's what I've been doing. However, I'm still getting flagged on some of my background music because I do use loops and stuff like that. But if you go to the support site, it's, it just clearly states that you can use this uh, software. It's out for the public and anybody can use it. As long as you're not selling loops as loops, you, you, you're, you're good to go, basically. So it's just annoying, but it's something that I've been dealing with, but I'm still making garage band music. Um, they're not professional, like I said. So I started looking online for some tutorials and I came across this great channel and I want to share with you guys. I do just kind of had a peek of it. Um, but his name, it, it, the, the, the channel is Skepsis Music, okay, or Site Strip Official. And basically what this guy does is he shows you step by step how to make music, dubstep, okay, in GarageBand. And I found his videos to be very helpful. Um, not only do I find his videos very helpful, but he has awesome, awesome music um, put together. So what I did was I messaged him and asked him if it was okay for me to use some of his mu music in my background music for my real-time videos. And he was like totally cool with that, which is awesome. So I have his message. So I'm going to be starting to add some of his music. Um, he also has um, an album out on iTunes and I wanted to kind of like share this with you because you know I, I, I think a lot of people make YouTube videos and they kind of shy away from music and stuff like that because of all this um, copyright infringement loss but um, you know he's he's I, I think um, he kind of also gives away his samples um, on Facebook page so I think you know if you Basically, like this is his Facebook and all he does is ask you to like his page and then if you do, you can go to his, listen to his music or downloads uh, and he has all these free samples on his, um, on this site here. It's just taking a few minutes to load. But basically, they're, they're all awesome stuff. So you can actually download um, like his samples, like this, uh, the, the drum sounds and things like that. Um, these are his music that you can, uh, oh, I'm having issues here. You can actually listen to, um, Cloud. I really like his style. Go to his site, go subscribe to his channel. If you are into making music or if you're interested in making, um, background music for your garage band or whatever, definitely give him a um, try. Go ahead and go through his videos. He does some really, really cool stuff. But anyhow, yeah, I'm, I'm still getting flagged and it's like, it's, you know, come on YouTube. I know it's automated, but you know, it's getting to be ridiculous. 
I, I, there's so many people that complains about ha, that have complaints about this as well. It's not just me, but basically what I'm doing is I'm just disputing it and say, hey, this is you know I made it from GarageBand. Apple says it's okay, so there shouldn't be any any um you know anything wrong with my videos. I do not post any videos where I have music aside from GarageBand. So there should not, this should not be the case. But anyways, I wanted to give a shout out to Skepsis Music. Go and check him out. That was the whole intent of the video. And just to kind of like share with you that I'm, you know, I'm having tons of fun with this GarageBand stuff. So, um, this is one of his, uh, one of the, uh, tutorial. I was following his tutorial <coughs> and I came across this sound and I will be using this for my next video. But that's that's I'm, I'm not gonna play the whole thing guys um, but basically that's that's what I created based on watching one of his videos and using his free samples of um, the drum sets drum sounds and things like that and then some other stuff that I'm using is just straight from the YouTube's uh, I'm, I'm sorry um, garage band um, software but this is it's really good stuff so i hope you go and check him out if you're interested in creating your own music and if you're getting flagged like me on uh using garage band um and you have some thoughts and ideas post your comments on my on my on this video and let me know i know i i've checked around other youtubers also having a similar issues and it's just really really annoying so anyhow, that's it guys. Take care and I'll see you um, in my next video. Bye. FreeDailyExercise.com Get it done at home.